this woman died, and then they pull out, and then they put in my beside of my sleeper for whole day and whole night. You know, I told you, you that you, you slept beside a dead yeah. body for one day. Not only me. Everybody. Second floor, third floor, fifth floor, just like that. My name is Slam Marosot from Thailand. I uh, was in uh, Thailand like as designer. So my name is Faisal, Muhammad Faisal. So I live in the Burma, Myanmar, so now. So I'm in the mechanic engineering. Uh, when did you come to uh, India? 25 of October last year. 25 of October last year. Okay, that's a long time you have been here. When you hear something, uh, first time of my life, I don't know about what the situation of the lockdown, what happened in the later, I don't know. But they said no flight, nothing. So that's why I know that I can't go back at that time. So I'm just preparing for what time will we go back and just waiting for that time. Okay. Do you have family, like do you have children, wife, and all back in Burma? Yeah, I have two children, so two years and six years. So they are also in the state in Burma. Okay. Do you miss them? <laughs> it's now one year. <laughs> when they ship us then to the new place is after one week after lockdown it's approximately 3rd of january or 30 of march something i could not remember i don't really know about ship us to somewhere they're saying some friends saying that we are going to picnic yeah. Uh, to in, going to the camp, so I, in my mind, thought about a picnic. So we should take uh, some Thai curry and some cooking pot with us. That's what I'm thinking uh, because I know that so it's gonna be a camp, you know, like it's gonna be fun. Yeah. After a few days, uh, full, you uh, know, covered with you know mass and you know. Everything, you know, the people, groups of the people came. They said, we're going to test all of these people who have virus and who have no virus, you know. After two days, they picked different, different countries around, you know, same Asia, Indonesia, around 10 people. Then Malaysia, around three people, Pakistan, and, you know, different, different countries. Almost all countries, people, I think around 70, 80 people, they said, you have a virus. Actually, they really tell me nothing, nothing at all. I try to find out what happened about myself and my friend, but we could not can get none of information. I think it was the 27th, 28th of March. I think that's, that's when the media started, you know, running uh, news and the audio clip of Mulan Asad. That uh, these people, there are a lot of people who have got corona and they are spreading corona and all these kind of nonsense but uh, <clears throat> i got even i got a little furious you know how can but you know when uh, the after the first news the first day then uh, browsing through the media channel it just looked that you know something which is not there is being created you know something unnecessary is being created they are picked to the quarantine center I stay in the quarantine center two months. They are text, so it is positive or negative, but my result is a negative. So two times they are tested, I'm a negative. I stay in the under control of the government. I'm not break any rule of the regulation of the India. So whatever they say, I just obey that. I'm not against anything. I'm not complain anything. So I just stayed in the quarantine center two months. After that, the May 18 or 26, so the library case will be happening. I don't know what case will be happening. So the case is now, you know, what, what about the case? I don't know the name of the case, but I would like to show for the government because of we didn't do any mistake in India. That's why we are trying the case. We didn't do any mistake. Then uh, we got to know that appropriate steps have been taken. You know, uh, there were notices from uh, the police officials from STM and these uh, notices were duly followed and uh, then we advised them that yeah you should uh, cooperate with the uh, agencies because this is for and they before telling uh, it to them that you know you have to follow the rules and guidelines and 
you have to cooperate they were already doing that so but on 31st we heard that uh, fir has been registered so the fir was registered under 188 269 270 and uh, epidemic act disaster management act my mother is uh, before he is very scared in the state time the lockdown because of he he she is a different priest i'm a different priest two months two months because he she can speak any language she, she can speak only bamis language but alhamdulillah she is not that time is a very difficult time i can't do nothing but alhamdulillah she is no she is a very strong <laughs> she is a very strong but you know what my family they don't know that i am dealing with the court thing they don't know about this <laughs> and then we got to go to the hospital the lok naya hospital i think lok naya hospital the day is ibratan i think yes ibratan school to school to uh, lok naya hospital, hospital infection disease hospital main hospital here they sent as beside of the hospital look like old building look like old building all the window is broken all the bed is you know you got to you got to support with the bridge to make valent back or the patient all window is broken you know uh i never seen before that much deadiest hospital in my life even you cannot find a pure fine water in the hospital they have a four or five flat hospital all the water found is damaging only that i climb water they have no pure pure fine water you cannot complain i want to go outside and get the water or you, you cannot do anything this just a security here you, you cannot get out from this hospital because you have a virus well we really doesn't uh, care much about outside media because we try to keep concentrate on ourselves or our mind that what we are doing much more than the uh, outside media what going on because so many story that have been on and on not just in india not just in thailand but it's all like everywhere my friend from america send me take me doors of this and i just like no i could not go that far so i just listen nothing how did you spend your time like it's been 10 months in india right now quiet <laughs> so there were used to be tabligi people there they used to when we are young they used to catch boys and tell you have to follow and all we were we just ran away we never see them we call them allah ki police aari hai and we should we always run so when i came to know each and everything my school friends most of them were non muslims they just tell me yeah okay this is wrong they should not have done this i was not able to answer them at that point and eventually at that time i was assigned by allah i don't know how but i was assigned with this work i got to know and my senior told me that this is the case we have to do this and the way he told it, the situations were very hard for us but eventually when the judgment came then i just talked to them i showed them ki this is good. this is the truth you can see now we even we even know we knew about the situation in you know so you can't really get out if you get out then you are violating the uh, guidelines but if you are inside if you stuck somebody somewhere so you are not violating any guidelines you are just there by force of circumstance so we fail to understand that how this fir is registered because these people are doing everything in their power and they even contacted the authorities that you tell us a plan you we will cooperate with you and we will try and evacuate these people outside the from the markets So I don't know about the media. I know I not listening anything because I stay in the quarantine. Because I not contact any person like media or something like that. Because I also I don't have a phone. Because I don't know the situation in outside. What happening going in outside? But I I stayed in the quarantine center. I stay in the another shift in the place. But the case will be happening. They are like misunderstanding to us to like the all of the foreigner people. They are misunderstanding. So that's why we would like to show the reality 
that's that's it that's why you stayed back yeah so how do you feel about uh, winning the case and like so that is a uh, before is i know i'm suffering because like misunderstanding each each other misunderstanding alhamdulillah we are now like eight months or nine months but the government of the the court the scat court they give the decision right decision so everybody know the situation what is the reality so i'm very happy for me and for all of the foreigner people and all over around the world they are very happy because of we didn't do any mistake that is a good reason for we uh, try the case i cannot believe on these news reports because there was nothing there was things which uh, which were not true at all i i gave a reply of two pages on 2nd of april to the crime branch and on the 3rd of april the times of india reported that an 11 page reply has been given i was shocked to see that something which has gone under my hand is is has completely changed when it went overnight so that was very shocking to me like you know how can this happen how can this happen so i just totally shut myself down from the media i used to watch it but i never used to get affected from it because i knew what was happening most of the time when i uh been to the like quiet time they just come to you and say what do you need what do you need what do you need you know keep saying that i feel like i'm i'm shame that i'm not strong enough sometimes when you are far away from the house you can just be quiet you know like you just sit yeah. looking and thinking something but uh that is not just because i'm weak yeah people die every day in that building two three people die every day two people die every day you know i never see the nurse looking check you know close to 30 days in the hospital every 70 day or 10 day they test test show negative all these 70 80 people amazing thing all these 70 80 double key people they could have find virus You know what we do after we arrive the hospital hospital is so dirty toilet you cannot use it only three toilet i think three toilet in the left side three toilet in the right side these toilets you cannot use it so much dirty and the all the blicky people cleaning the all toilet cleaning the floor no trash after flies and you know your know, mosquitoes and you know I never ever seen before in my life. This is a hospital, you know. I have no idea, you know. One of the old lady fall down from the bed on the ground and then die for 6 7 hour. No nurse, no doctor. One of the one of the Indian Hindi guy, the Jian guy, is very his heart is so, you know, kind and you know, very nice guy. He told me this lady is dead, you know. Not breathing. You, I don't know man how I can do you know no nurse and no doctor in this that floor you know how where i can go you know i cannot do anything she no breathe for 6 7 hour on the ground lady age around 55 60 not only that that old lady one of the old man going to the toilet 70 80 people for only three toilet one toilet is you cannot use it only two toilet is good so the the the, the the middle of the toilet this old man get in i think is around 45 get inside of the toilet and then two hour three hour never came out and then people said this guy is using too loud it's not possible you know finally or one of the cleaning guy came in and he, uh kept the trash and then he broke the door and you know, finally this old man died inside of the toilet and at that time they had a flight at the flight was at 5 pm they were at uh, there were 13 people at uh, 13 to 14 people of indonesia and the passports were in the court and it was two we asked the judge we all we gave the all the legal definitions and all whatever we can the arguments we did and the judge allowed them the first thing they did when we told them you can go home you are going home and today's your flight and the flight was there 6:45 or 7 at the, the embassy man came and told us he the flight is at 7 so if they leave till 3 of 3 and a half, uh, 3:30 they reach uh, airport by 4 i'll arrange all the tickets for them and they can go home today and they knew that they can go home that day so they had already packed their bags 
they were just waiting the first thing they did they started crying second thing they kissed my senior's hand they hugged us they kissed my hand third thing they were offered namaz there in the court fourth thing was they just called their family and they just video conference and uh, these guys are helped us this guy and this guy and at that moment i was so emotionally low and i didn't knew what to say and what to do and they were just they were just kissing her hands and just, i i didn't have any words at that time but we can do nothing we can do nothing we are just only patient we are just only uh how can i say that we are just only suffering in my life we can do nothing but alhamdulillah we only pray the namaz we only do the dua does it how did your family manage back in brahma so family. after that i go outside the quarantine center and just contact to them so they are very worried about them i said no worry about them so everything is okay alhamdulillah so they are but suffering <laughs> I said, just only you can you contact to Allah. Allah will be sorry to our problem. And your children, you used to call them. Or? Yeah, I always call them. I talking with my children, my family, but I'm not talking about anything, because they will be worried. They will be, you know, the healthy will be not good position. I know that everything okay. Alhamdulillah, we are good position, good fine. Inshallah, we will be coming back as soon as possible. I just talking like that because I'm not talking anybody. I'm just only talking. We just only pray the namaz. We do the dua. Allah only sorted out the problem. And Allah sorted out yeah, the problem. No problem. Nobody not can do like that. Not only that case, everything. Indian boy or Indian people like my brother, all of them are just super. I love them. I'll, I'll, I'll come back definitely for sure. India is gonna be my second house now. So, what about the government decisions and the media trail? I said to you that I didn't hear nothing about the media and the new outside. I don't concentrate about that. Just thank Allah. Thank for Allah. Thankful for Allah that He keep me like um not that person that who. Into the new, you know. I'm not, not anymore. I have enough of my world. I just have to stop about this. I really concentrate on what I'm going to. You know, I just could not wait my time around here anymore. It's too silly for me. Yeah.